Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So with the recent upgrade from Edge Canary version 117 to 118, which is now the latest preview release of the Edge browser, Microsoft has introduced a couple of new flags in Edge Canary version 118, which if you are interested in, because I know a lot of you do test um, new features in Edge Canary, just to show you a couple of these new flags. Now, the first is regarding handwriting to text. And this is a brand new flag. And to get to the experimental flags page, as many of you will know by now, we enter edge colon forward slash forward slash flags into the address bar. Now, to bring up the flag handwriting to text, we just type in handwriting. That's enough. And there we go, handwriting to text. And the description for the flag reads, allows inking via pen to be converted into typed text on most text input fields in Microsoft Edge. This is available only on devices where handwriting is supported. To check where the handwriting to text is enabled on your device, look for use your handwriting to enter text in Windows settings. So if you do that search in your Windows setting, use your handwriting to enter text, um, and you do have the feature enabled and it is handwriting to text is enabled on your device, then you'll be able to use this in Edge. Now, I don't have handwriting to text enabled on this device. So I cannot show you in real time, but if you want to try out the feature as always, just change the default to enabled, restart Edge Canary version 118 to apply that flag. And now obviously that'll allow you to um, ink via pen um, to be converted into type text on most text input fields in Microsoft Edge Canary. Now the next couple of flags actually, there's a whole bunch of new flags that have been rolled out for a new feature in Edge called FedCM. So just enter FedCM into the search. And there we go. All of those are highlighted in yellow. So there's a good couple, plenty of FedCM flags. And what this feature is all about um, is it stands for Federated uh, Credential Management. And according to the Chrome developers website, because obviously Edge is based on the open source Chromium platform, uh, FedCM which stands for Federated Credential Management, is a proposal for a privacy-preserving approach to federated identity services. And they give an example such as Sign In With, where uh, you can log into sites without sharing your personal information with the identity service um, or the site. So basically, it's a bit of a privacy and security feature. And as mentioned, a whole lot of flags have rolled out. Now, um, where this will all benefit, according to uh, the uh, Chrome a developer's um, website, where this will be um, of benefit is they say that Identity Federation has played a central role in raising the bar for authentication on the web in terms of trustworthiness, ease of use, and yeah, they give, um, for example, passwordless single sign-in and security, for example, improved resistance to phishing and credentials uh, stuffing attacks compared to per site usernames and passwords. So basically, this is a bit of a a privacy and a security update. So if you want to try this feature out, um, you can just enable all of those flags, FedCM, and um, each of those, obviously, if you want to know more about each flag, have got the description underneath. So as mentioned, a couple of those flags now, new flags rolling out in Edge Canary version 118, handwriting to text, and a whole bunch regarding the new fed cm so thanks for watching and i will see you guys in the next one